you believe in fundamental economics, then uh, at some point uh, this must be inflationary. Mm. Inflation, inflation, inflation. <laughs> yeah, I think what we can say categorically is that the inflation scare from the relative price highs in commodities was a head fake. Yeah. It was a head fake at a massive cyclical turning point for the economy. This is profoundly deflationary. Yeah? Um, we keep talking about monetization, quantitative easing, huge budget deficits. Um, all of this is untested. Yeah? Um, Japan has been the proponent and been the only one to pursue quantitative easing. Yeah? Where is the Nikkei 18 years later? Yeah? It's still making new loads. So quantitative easing isn't necessarily a panacea. And for all the talk about ra rising levels of government debt, it's occurring at the same time as corporate and personal sector debt is contracting. So they're cancelling themselves out and they're leaving us with this deflation. But I think you're right with your emphasis on index linked. Now, you're saying 2% is the break-even level in the, in the UK. You should be buying my American securities because the break-even rate is 6%. So I have a security in America where I almost want to lose money. I almost want to lose money on this thing because I, I can't lose money in real terms. I'm guaranteed six real, okay? For me to lose money, prices in America have to fall 6% next year and 6% the year after that. That's, that's almost never, never happened. But let's say it does, and let's say prices fall 20% over that period. Do you know where the S&P will be? It'll be like 300 points, yeah? yeah? And I will have lost 10%. Okay, so, you know, I'll be a giant amongst dwarfs at that point. Likewise, yourself. I mean, is there any emphasis on the index link element? I mean, it would seem to be a screaming buy. Senior portion of the capital structure, huge yield premium. It is not, there's no such thing as a screaming buy. <laughs> Wash your mouth out, you silly man. Well, if you, you buy know. like, like government debt, why not buy no. the bank debt? that is guaranteed by the government where you get 300 extra basis points. The only sensible thing you can say mm -hmm. is that there is a massive disconnect between the corporate bond market, the, the price of Vodafone selling debt, mm -hmm. and the price of its equity. Yeah. One of those markets is wrong. Mm -hmm. One of those markets has strategists and permabills, mm -hmm. and one of them called the bond market has professional people, mm -hmm. okay? So my money's on the bond market Me being too. more right, <laughs> being more right than the equity market, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. But that's as bullish as I can get. Yeah, well, they got GM right. Bryn, thanks a lot for joining us this morning. Bryn Jones, 